A project to replace stormwater drains in one Pasco County neighborhood may be leaving residents with even more problems than they started with. We're talking about several blocks surrounding Martell Street in Newport Ritchie. As Eric Waxler shows us, neighbors say flooding issues that were supposed to be resolved are worse now than ever. May. Oh. It's not a photo album filled with great memories. This was before they fixed the storm sewers. Kathy Idarola has saved dozens of pictures of the flooding that's plagued her Newport Ritchie neighborhood. The last three years, I've really been complaining about it. After the county hired a construction company to replace drain pipes, residents here thought things were about to improve. They keep asking us if it's better, and I don't think it is. I don't think it's much of an improvement for all the work they did. The flooding continues down these streets, and it was at its worst after heavy rains hit on Saturday. It was a torrential downpour. It rained hard. I would say we probably got about an inch and a half to two inches in an hour. This is what it looked like on Martell Street. Some neighbors say a portalet leaked sewage, and the Bandos are worried because they say diesel fuel from a pump leaked onto their property. All of my pool, ground, all over the house, through the garage, everywhere. I talked with Pasco's stormwater management director. He says he believes the amount of diesel that leaked was minimal, but the county will still take soil samples and do whatever they can to respond to the problem. He also says a clogged pipe led to the excess flooding Saturday. County officials told me they are very unhappy with mistakes made by the construction company contracted to do the work, and they doubt they will ever use them again. Still, two days later, water is flowing down the streets, and in it, a slippery substance that could be dangerous. I saw a woman fall on her butt uh, the other day just because of what's left on the ground from the standing water. In the meantime, work continues to fix the problem once and for all. And Kathy will be around taking pictures every step of the way. In Newport Ritchie, Eric Waxler, ABC Action News.